Welcome everybody to another Matt Winnick golf video. Today I'm with Walter. We're out at Rancho Solano Golf Club in Fairfield, California, playing a six hole stroke play challenge here. I am giving Walter one stroke per hole and let's see, uh, let's see who can take the W out here. First hole is par five, uh, a little bit of water to the left. You want to kind of favor the right side of the fairway here. So two good drives in play and we're both in the fairway. We got 223 of the hole. It's a lot wetter than it looks right there, guys. That was a pretty tough lie. Anytime you hit the ground at all, your club's just gonna suck into there, so. It was a tough one, but Wally had a nice recovery shot right here. So he'll be up there chipping on. Luckily it's par five. Got one with the six iron here. Kinda got a little quick with it. Hold it a little bit, but not bad. Pretty good. It's nice being out playing golf. Wish I'd have gotten a couple practice swings in, but hey, I'm not complaining. Putter's gonna be hot. Putter's gonna be hot today. You guys heard it first. The putter's gonna be hot. Right, we got Walt over here. He's got a little chip. There's the hole. I think Walt has a 56 right there. Pretty good chip. Good. I think I went with the 56 as well. 56 pretty much my standard go to on the round the greens. Tap that one in for par. Walt got up and down for par and because he uh, got a stroke on that hole he is up one right now. Next hole here is par four. Up 325 yards, uh, dog leg left a little bit. Kind of just wanted to put one right over those two little trees right in front of you. You can see right there, but push it a little bit. Not complaining. Got a good uh, good bounce out of the bunker, so I got I'm happy. Yards. I'm going to grab a little 56. I've actually been practicing this one, so let's watch me eat my own words. He caught it a little heavy there. That was a tough ball above the feet lie out of the rough, but he's up there. Matt caught an interesting lie off the green trunk. He's got a 56 in the hand. Again, hitting 56 right here. Caught it actually pretty solidly. A lot more solid than I expected, but got pretty close from there. Not, I'm not happy with that. Another good chip from Wally. Putting's been decent today. I've been leaving everything high above the cup, which is good. So hopefully I can just get it dialed in here and get the reads on. That's a very unfortunate three putt for bogey right there. So Walter and I tied on that hole, but with his stroke, he is up one more. So this hole, another par four, about 365 or so. Um, not really any hazards in play. Again, he's kind of ball above the feet. Caught this one much cleaner. As this shot, I mean, I, I, from way back there, I couldn't see where it landed. I thought it was perfect. I thought I was going to be within a foot of the hole. I went, hit my spot exactly where I wanted to be, and it just, just didn't get it. But doesn't matter. Drop the birdie putt. Let's go. So again, because that was a. Par four, he got a par, I got a birdie, we ended up tying. So he is still up two. Next hole here, another about 360 yard 
par four um, to be able to cut the corner a little bit. You kind of just want to take the line I just hit right there, just go over those trees. I think Walter went just just before them, so got a little bit of a tough shot here. Gets through. Just got to look at the green from the other side there. All right, guys, I got 94 yards. I got 52 here. Nice little 52, about a 100-yard shot. That's about my three-quarter 52. That's about how far it goes. Again, push it to the right a little bit, but still in the green putting. Walter got that one a little chunky again. Tough lie. It was a tough lie. I'm not sure he... I think he might have missed the ball there, or barely hit it, or I'm not really sure. But anyway, second time's a charm. It was a great out right there. Nice out, Walter. Guys, I wasn't sure on this one whether to putt it, chip it. I had that sprinkler head right in my way. Ended up putting it. Thought I gave myself a pretty good lag there, but what do you guys think? Chip that or put that? Let me know in the comments. I guess I gave that one to Wally. You're welcome, Wally. Another unfortunate lip out. So this is a little par three, pretty tough par three, about 175 to the pin. A little bit downhill. Only put the pressure on me here, and as you can see, I did not rise to the occasion. Again, just left it out to the left, got a little fast with it. Almost made that chip. Off the fly. I think he read a lot more break than what was actually there. I think that was the line there for me, guys. I just didn't hit it hard enough. How does it be hot? How does it be hot today? What was that, Wally? What was that, Wally? Yeah, he just had no confidence after that last one. Unfortunate. I think I picked up one there. Will it be enough? Next hole here, last hole, par four again, uh, about 340 yards. Seems to be about the theme between 340 and 360 for these par fours out here in Rancho Solano. Kind of pushed mine to the right, gave myself a horrible lie behind some trees, made another bad decision trying to go over the trees followed by a punch out into a tree. Another bad decision, kind of lost confidence there as well, but was able to finally get a clear opening where I can actually hit a, hit a normal shot and Push stuck down. it up there. So I think at this point, Wally's got this thing uh, in the bag, but we'll play it out because you just never know. Nice shot, Wally. That was a much more confident stroke, even though it was still a little short. Tough putting day, guys. Nice par, dude. Thanks. Walt absolutely crushed me on this uh, today's stroke play match. I'd like to thank Wally for joining me out here today. Anytime. Thanks for beating me. I won't invite you again. Take it easy, guys. See you on the next one. Thank you.